My next guest tonight, Friday, is uh, is a very, very attractive actress. Uh, someone goes first to say sexy, and I'd be amongst them. Uh, there's a the, she's in the the new film Avatar, the one I was talking about tonight. <laughs> it's in theaters right now. Take a look at this. I like her. <laughs> I like a girl that can fly a helicopter. <laughs> Please welcome the lovely Michelle Rodriguez, everybody. Uh, what happens in talk shows is they give the uh, host of the talk show a little list of questions to ask uh, whoever guest is on the show. And my contention always is, if I needed a list of questions to talk to a woman like you, I shouldn't be in show business in the first place. <laughs> Right on. You see I what I'm it. saying? I like your pants, by the way. Oh, thank you, Stella McCartney. You know she knows how to make. She you know, made those pants. And there's, yeah. there, there's, you get a few holes coming in. I know, I know. Makes it nice and breezy. Do you know what? Get nervous and sweaty. No, you. <laughs> do you get nervous and sweaty? Yes, yeah, sometimes. On your no. legs. <laughs> <laughs> All right, stop it. All right. Yeah. Do you know what I'm just thinking? I was just thinking, though, if you wanted the reverse of these pants, you could put them on, then get a Sharpie and go all over your legs, and then take the pants off and, hey, presto, the reverse <laughs> pants. Plus a chance of a, a job in 101 Dalmatians, the remake, because... <laughs> you know, I think I might actually try that Do one it. day. Or just get it tattooed in the areas. Maybe for Halloween. It's very similar to the Navi pattern on their on their faces. Oh, the Navi's the name of the people in the movie, yeah, right? Yeah, the blue guys. The blue guys, yeah, the Navi. <laughs> Do you, can you fly a helicopter? I, no. Uh, no. no. I'm well, that's sorry. all the time we have. <laughs> But I Have did, you ever I, tried? I trained. Yes, I did fly over Los Angeles, and he and he and and the the, the guy who was teaching me how Not to fly. Not Lance. Huh? Was it Lance out of our nice, the helicopter instructor? No, 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 no. no, 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 no. He, he's amazing, though. And <laughs> what was his name? I forget his name. Ah, sir. I'm so sorry. Yeah, that's all right. Um, but yeah, he let me control the cyclic, and that thing is so, it's so sensitive. I, I mean, know. like with a pinky, you can... I've done it. Yeah? Yeah, yeah, you yeah. fly? Yeah, yeah, I fly a plane. Choppers? Yeah, I've flown a chopper once. What do, what do you fly? I fly a little Cessna. Do you have a license? license? Yeah, yeah, I'm a qualified pilot. That is awesome, ah, man. suddenly a middle-aged white guy got a little more attractive. <laughs> Yeah, I fly planes. No, I sure, say. I fly upside down. I, uh, no, I don't, it's I don't. really hot. Yeah, it's it's, it's, it's a hot thing to know how to fly. Would you like to learn how to yeah, fly? Yes, I would. I would I'm not qualified to teach you, but <laughs> I know some people who'd be overjoyed to teach you. Yeah, I'm yeah. definitely down. I think I prefer the chopper thing, though. Yeah. It's really awesome. Yeah, it's very, very fun. I, I flew one a little bit, but it, it, when you just, you can't move the stick at all. It's just the slightest no. little thing. It's, yeah, I know. It's awesome. Yeah, yeah. I don't know. Are you a thrill seeker? Do you yeah, like that kind thing? of. Really? What about jumping out of planes? You ever done that? I do that all the time. I you do it. not? Yes, I do. I would never do that. I'm only 10 jumps strong, though. Yeah. What does that mean? That means that I've only jumped 10 times. I see. Yeah. <laughs> Well, you don't do it all the time then, do you? You lied to me. No, I yeah. did, I did, I did. But have you done it on your own? Yeah, once. Wow. Once I did it on my own. And my best friend decided that he wanted to come with me, man. He broke his ankle in three places. Yeah, that was his first time. Did he break? <laughs> he said, Leah, I'll jump out. I don't want to do it with a guy behind me. I'm like, you he sure did it on about his own? that? <laughs> well, there's something about, for certain guys, not all guys, but for some guys being strapped to another guy behind you. <laughs> Even at 30 or whatever, what, do you, what height do you jump out at? 14, I think, 14,000. 14,000 yeah. feet? 14,000 feet. Oh, no, I so couldn't do awesome, that. So awesome, man. No. Ah, oh, dude, it No, I know so how good. to fly the plane. I know how to get it back on the ground. I don't need to jump out. <laughs> Even if the engine goes, they teach you how to land it without the engine. <laughs> can you do that in a helicopter? Mm, I don't think you can. You can? You can? Mm -hmm, you it's can called, dive bomb it? No, you auto gyro. It goes down the other way and you spin it down like that. See, I would you, never try you it. You know but, a lot uh, about this stuff. I do, I'm a pilot, you have to learn that. That rocks. Man. Yeah, they don't, you don't just turn up and they go, hey, I'm on TV, and they go, oh, well, there's your pilot's license. I was in a movie, oh, help yourself, take any of our planes. 
That would be awesome, though. Yeah, well, it would be great, yeah. It would make some very interesting flying. <laughs> I, I think you should try. I think it's a great thing. Were you ever frightened of it or anything like that? Mm, I was sweating a lot. Yeah? Yeah. What frightens you if you're kind of like, you're kind of action girl? Deep, deep water. Deep really? water frightens me, yeah. Mm. I, I, that's one thing that I'm still scuba scared. Scuba diving, have you ever done that? That's how you get over it. I am too scared to scuba dive um, because that's mm. deep water stuff. Yeah, but so. don't go that deep at first. Yeah, but... Just like I, get waist deep, put your head for in. For that, what, and, do uh, what do I need the scuba gear for? Well, you, you, I'm baby steps, baby steps, Michelle. You get in a swimming pool at the shallow end, you put on the thing, you learn how to use it. <laughs> and then uh, that's how I learned to be a qualified scuba diver also. Oh, no. yeah. <laughs> You're getting uber mojo points That's tonight. That's what I'm telling uber you. Uber mojo points I tonight. think you'd love it. And you wear a lot of clothing like that, actually, when you go to school with <laughs> Are you frightened of the critters? Is that what it is? Do you know? Yeah, like you know, not knowing what's five feet in front of you in the deep ocean, you know, you could barely see I more know. than five feet in front of you. Everything else is dark, no matter what direction you're looking. And it's scary, you know? Yeah, what about dark rooms? <laughs> <laughs> not so much. Well, you don't know what's all around you. I mean, for here, for example, you can't see five feet in front of you here. <laughs> Yeah, but I don't mind that so much. Yeah, it's all right. We're over here. Everything's <laughs> fine. You can move your hands a lot faster when there's air. Are you a good fighter? I think I can. I can really? handle myself. Any martial arts or anything like no, that? No, nothing professional. Just some street, you know, ah, yeah. street wiseness. <laughs> I know what to aim for to get you to stop. <laughs> <laughs> yes, and I think you just hit it. Uh, what is that? That's my cup. You like it? Yeah, I got that on a wreck dive. <laughs> that is an interesting piece of work right there. Yeah, it's a snake cup from the Albuquerque Rattlesnake Museum. Do you enjoy snakes? I do. I love snakes. Yeah. It looks more like the kind of gift you'd get at a rap party for natural born killers. Yeah. <laughs> It kind of occasionally makes me think about going on a killing spree when I use it. <laughs> it's quite go a little nuts. Uh, so what about guns? You play with guns? I do. I play with guns a lot. I like oh, it. It's fun. Of, what kind of guns? I'm not are? a great shot, though. I right. have to improve definitely my aim. But I can take apart an M4 and put it back together in less than a minute. Shut I'm good at up. cleaning guns. Really? Yeah. Why? Good at shooting them. I just, you know, can't have hit to what you're aiming at. Just I need a lot of bullets to get to it. But I have no problem. <laughs> no problem whacking them off, though. And I got lots of ammunition. <laughs> Welcome to the part of the show that we call Double Entendre Review. I got no problem whacking them off, though. I've got plenty of ammunition. You're welcome, 18 to 13, you 40 year old uh, male demographic. Hey, we're out of time. Will you come back again? Yes, I I'm very excited about this to. movie, by the way. Yeah, it, I hope you like it. I will Definitely like it, I'm sure. It I'm out. sure. It looks fantastic. You know, and, and that 3D experience is just a whole new world. Man. I know, it's like looking out the window. <laughs> <laughs> I'm very excited about but it. But at an imaginary world. At a, looking out the window to another planet. Yeah, another yeah. realm. And I think yeah. that's the main attraction. You can't find that at a theater. That's right. You have to go to another planet. Planet. Yeah. Mm. <laughs> All right, it's been lovely to meet with you, Michelle. <laughs> Michelle, you everybody, 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 everybody.